Smith woman saved by three heroes. Police say she was actually going to be kidnapped by her estranged husband, all while holding her baby. Well, that's when those three good Samaritans stepped in and saved the day. WBC's Christina Rex has the story live from Plymouth tonight. Christina. Yeah, Chris, tonight Plymouth police are praising those three men. They actually plan to give them awards because they say they helped save this woman from a potentially very dangerous situation. It was everything. We feel that, that these men probably saved this woman's life. Police are crediting Good Samaritans for saving a woman's life in a Plymouth neighborhood Friday. Came home, they grabbed a couple things and noticed that there was an altercation going on across the street. They heard a kid screaming and lady yelling. Jamie Costa was the first there when one of his neighbors screamed for help. Police say her estranged husband violated a restraining order when he showed up to the house in a mask with two guns and tried to kidnap her with her baby in her arms. As I uh, got closer to the road, I noticed uh, a gentleman dragging the lady and our, I believe, a daughter up this hill. And I could tell at that point in time that she was struggling and it, it was for real. So Jamie jumped in and tackled the man to the ground. Two brothers doing work in the area then jumped in too, and one of them pulled his gun on the suspect. Made a point to be known to this gentleman that he had a gun, and uh, if he wasn't going to cooperate, that it was going to get ugly. They held the man on the ground until police arrived and arrested him. As it turns out, the suspect's guns weren't real, just replicas allegedly used to scare the victim. Which is becoming more and more of a problem in most communities. Uh, these handguns look very authentic. Um, you know, there, there isn't much on these handguns that separate what a toy and what an actual gun looks like. Police say they're grateful for the men who intervened. In fact, this was Jamie Costa's second time tackling a violent suspect. But he doesn't want to be called a hero. As a man, it's kind of your responsibility, I guess, is how I was taught to help out. So I just helped out. And that suspect is being held without bail here at the Plymouth De Police Department. Now they say that that woman, the victim, is okay physically and she's expected to be okay. Live in Plymouth, Christina Rex, WBZ News.